For the Corps of Engineers, the onset of cold weather signals the beginning of dive season. While perhaps not an official season, most dive work is scheduled between November and March when salmon runs are at their lowest. A team of divers suited up at Ice Harbor to perform the required three-year inspection of the removable spillway weir. We're doing a dive inspection on the RSW. We inspect uh, um, all different components of the RSW, make sure that one, it's still working, um, uh, identify any sort of deficiencies that need to be addressed um, in, in follow-up work. Um, we're inspecting the air and water piping system as well as the structure and for any, any sort of obvious anomalies. Um, where uh, also the divers will also be getting down as far down as 85 feet uh, to inspect the hinges, the hinge connection, um, and any, pretty much anything they could find. It's going to be a five-man dive team plus a two-man team on a chase boat. The U.S. Associated Underwater Services, and we're a commercial dive company. So we do marine, mainly marine construction, but we also do inspections or repairs for investigations uh, with the Army Corps of Engineers. This particular task is down to 80 feet below the water. That's the only way to get accurate investigation or inspection. Um, so there are ROVs that can use little radio control robots kind of, but it's best to have an actual person down there doing hands-on work for it, for sure. Everything will just be uh, talked about together, videotaped, and then uh, assessed. The dive investigation will be used to decide if potential repairs are needed for the RSW to ensure it's good working condition before juvenile salmon start traveling downriver this spring.